Hello everybody, Evil Do Master and welcome back to another video. So I already show you guys the strong zone for each race for Horde Alliance. So now today I'm gonna show you um, all the Horde and Alliance cities how it used to be in Classic and how is it right now in Retail WoW. So I'm gonna show you guys how Under City used to be in Classic and then I'll stretch it to Retail how is it right now. So this is my character. I'm level uh, 111 so far. And this is what the map looks like for Under City. So if you go to Under City, this is where it used to be in Classic. This is the map. So now I'm going to give you guys a tour how Under City used to be in Classic. So I'm going to be making my way to the pathway. So this is the entrance to go to Under City. You got some flags. So there's a lot of flags in here. And uh, we're gonna start heading inside the entrance. Now, there's an Easter egg in the Under City. So if I can uh, uh, lower my volume. Let's see here. I'm not sure if you guys can hear it though, but if you go into the entrance or the middle, you can probably hear it. Alright, so anyways, this is the middle of Honor City. So let's go up here. So this is what Honor City used to be. There's a uh, door right there. There's a lot more stuff over here. More over there. So there's like a lot of doors over here. And uh, we're gonna go to the other side now. Alright, now we're gonna go up here. And same thing on the other side. There's doors and walls. There's nothing important. Okay, so now we're going to uh, go straight forward. And then this is like a, a this is a uh, broken statue that used to be there. And there's a graveyard. There's some tombstones that somebody died. And there's more over here. And then there's uh, a tree stump that used to be a tree over there. There's a, uh, a broken lamp that used to be there too. So this used to be the human of the Lord of one before it got like destroyed by the undead or something. Alright, so now this is um, some slime. It can and you cannot die in it, so that's a good thing. There's a uh, tunnel you can get to. So I'll show you this tunnel. So this is like a secret tunnel you can get to in the city. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, lots of things over here. Alright, so now... I think there's like another tunnel if you go to the other way. Which is... Yeah, here you go. This is another one too. So let's go this way and there we go, another tunnel. So yeah, same place. Okay, so now we're going to start heading inside the Undercity. So this is the outside of it so far. 
And now we'll make my way inside the end of the city. So the only there's two ways you can enter, left and right. So we wanna go this way. And then we got some uh, a broken statue, a chair fell down. And if you guys if, if you guys can listen very closely, there's some bells you can actually hear. Now, um, in Warcraft 3, when you complete the final um, chapter of the human campaign, when Arthur s starts to see his dad and s come over here, you can listen to... Though, uh, these are the bells of the same thing in the cinematic of uh, Warcraft 3, The Wind of Chaos. So now they must have added in WoW in Undercity. So I'm gonna sh I'll be I'm gonna see if you guys can hear the bells. So yeah, if you guys hear the bells, that that's going that's an Easter egg from the Warcraft Three. If you guys can hear the bells. Alright, so now I'm gonna go this way. And then if you can hear very uh quiet or if you can hear the people cheering, that's no Easter egg. There's a statue right there, another statue right there. And now we're in the throne room. Now, if you can hear the people talking in the background when you see the cinematic for the... Oh, here we go. So... Yeah, I'm not too sure if you guys can hear it though. It's very hard to tell. So yeah, anyways, um this is the throne room where Well, uh, Arthur's dad sits here, and then when Arthur came over here, he killed his dad, and I think there's some, should be a blood spot somewhere, unless that's been taken away. Yeah, I don't see it now. It must be gone. Okay, so anyways, let's start heading inside the other city. So, there's some plaques if you want to see. So, here's Lies of King Terence Mithil the the second. So, here's Lies King Terence Vincent the second, last true king of Lordaeron. Great were his deeds, long was his re resign, uh, un un uh, unthinkable was his death. May the father lie... Bless Blemethus for the deeds of the sun. May the bl bloody crown stay lost and forgotten. And then there's another one which is. Oh no, it's just one. Okay, never mind. Alright, so there's like multiple um, doorways you can go. One over there. And there's one over there. One over there. And that's it. So there's like three doors you can go to. Let's see if I can uh, get to it before it closes. Oh, no, it closes. And there's uh, level 55 guardians. The abominations. Now I gotta wait till it opens again. Alright, so I'm inside. I'm inside the other city. I mean, the, the door.
Alright, so now... This is what honestly looks like right now, which is in retail. I mean, uh, classic. Here's the banks. Hello. Now, in classic WoW, guild vaults or guild banks did not exist when the game first came out. You have to wait for the Bone and Crusade expansion when that came out. Then you can have access to the guild vaults or guild banks. Now, when the, um, Bone and Crusade came out for guild banks, uh, these right here used to be a guild bank. It has like a skull on it, and then you can click on it, and that's how you access your guild bank. Alright, so this is your bank to get access, and there's like a another bank. This is a ghost. And you can actually go through it too. So, just like that, you can actually go through the bank wall. Alright, so let's start uh, with the top. Okay, so. Over here, this is the general trade supplies. I have exactly what you need. So we can buy some trade supplies. Watch your back. And there's another vendor. This is my armor. God all day. Do not seek death. And then this is your heavy armor. What now? Speak quickly. And this I'm is listening. another one. Farewell. And then over here we have Speak quickly. a weapon merchant. So we can buy stuff here. I have exactly what you need. And then Farewell. this is the weapon merchant. If you want to buy some weapons, our time will. And this is like a PVP thing, so I'm not it? worried about what this. Now? And over here, this is your. Uh, flight master to go somewhere else. So this is the uh, bat handler. So I don't have any uh, flight pass to go to at the moment. So yeah, this is to ride your to get to the flight master. And then we have the general trade goods. What do you require? Bye. And uh, we here. We have another trade goods. Hello. And over here is this complete empty. Uh, what else? What's over here? Uh, then we have a regent vendor. Quick about your business. So you can buy some regents. And then over here we got the inner keeper. Speak quickly. So you can set your hearthstone and then make it your inn. I haven't got all day. And this is your stable master. If you're a hunter, you can only stable three pets at a time. Trust There's no. a mailbox right there for the mail something. And I think yeah. So that's everything I have to show you guys for the top. So now we're gonna go to the bottom. Alright, so now I'm on the bottom. We're going to go this way. So, this is to uh, make your guild. This is the Under City this had better be uh, good. Census. And this Very is the Tabio Designer. After you form your guild and where to go. And it costs 10 gold to make the Tab Yard. What is this? This is the Guild Master. If you are trying to form a guild, and you need ten guild uh, signatures to uh, make the guild, Quick and this is the tablet vendor to buy the guild tablet. It costs one gold. And let's see, anything else I miss? Is there anything? Oh, here we go. So here's Jeremiah Payson. What is? So he's a cockroach vendor, so you, you can buy a, a cockroach for 50 silver, which is these cockroaches right here. And let's see here. Um, here's a uh, cooking trainer. And you are. If you have a cooking profession. There's what is it? Cooking supplies. Be and cool. next chef. 
And I think that's everything down here. So now we're gonna check out uh, inside the Venice City, which is more stuff. So we got some guards. Here's the auction hat, the auction ale. If you wanna check something for an auction ale. And uh, over here we have another auction ale. And over here we got some two uh, undead just walking by. So there's another auction uh, auction ale up there too. And then there's another one up there too. So yeah, there's like I think four auctioneers in here. So there's another one up there, and there's another one up here. And let's see, is anything up here? So this is what the map looks like, right in the classic. Um. Okay, so yeah, there's like four four auctioneers, and there's like a another undead just walking by. All right, so now we're gonna go inside the hallway. So we're gonna start out with uh, the apothecum, or how you pronounce that name. So we're gonna go this way. Alright, so now over here, if you go over here, you got some enchanting. This is your enchanting vendor. If you uh, have an enchanting profession, you go here. This is a train. There's your supplies for enchanting. Hello. And then there's an expert for it. And then over here, there's nothing over there, so there's nothing over there. Uh, over here we got a uh, and you are. blue moon odds and ends, which is a bag vendor, I guess, which is food testing. And then up over here we have um, an obelisk vendor. I'm listening. So if you're an obelisk, you come over here to train. I'm listening. And then uh, there's some um, bag if you want. And then we've got a crystal veil, empty veil, and a leaded veil if you're an alchemist. Probably buy this right now. Alright, there we go. Alright. So, continue the the um the the under city how it used to be all right so now we're gonna go up the ramp and we're going to uh, go over here we got two under city guardians protecting this area now this looks like a some kind of giant bug it seems. I have no idea what's this supposed to be. Alright, so you can't like go over there and get to it, so it's blocked off. So we're gonna go inside. Oh look I found Can I help you? some gnome named Ganoush. And we're going to go downstairs up here. So this is the some kind of lab. So this is an alchemist lab, by the way, not uh, like a normal lab. So here's your alchemist. If you want to learn alchemy, what now? You have to I'm go to. Hello. Uh, let's see. This guy? No. Let's see. Who do you go to? And you. Um, I don't see any trainers you can find. Did I pass them up somewhere? Are you the? What would you ask? Oh, here we go. Yeah, this is your trainer to learn alchemy. 
if we have knockers. Alright, so let's check out what this looks like. So there's the royal, uh, up, I don't know how, it's the royal apothecary. And then there's a tarin. What now? And then over here, there's like a human's trapped in a cage. And then she's crying because they got stuck in a cage. Okay, so they're all crying for help. All right. Um. Okay, so what's over here? Okay, so there's nothing over here. Okay, so it's nothing over important. So now let's go upstairs. And we're going to uh, go this way. And we're going to walk out. So I already show you uh, this room so far. Did I miss going over down there? Oh, I have a down a bit. Let me see if I can go over there. Um, I don't think I did, but been over there yet. Okay, so I must have missed it then. Okay, so I need to go that way, go up here, and it should be. If you walk this way, okay, maybe it's this way. Is this it? No, it's the. I don't know. How are you gonna get to that pathway? Mm, is there like a missing pathway I'm supposed to go to? Like it's supposed to be heading that way, but does it go? Nothing to go to. Huh. I don't know. Maybe I gotta keep going the other way. Maybe that's why. Let's try that. So, okay, so I already show you guys the apothecium. Now we're gonna go into the rogues corridor. After I uh, get to that one spot. So now we're gonna start heading the Queen's room, which is this is where Savannah goes to. So there's two unique undead guards guarding the base. I mean her Queen's throne room. Some more guards. Okay, so I'm going the right way this time. Okay, so there's more undead guards. And there's more undead guards guarding this entrance. And there's Lady Savannah right there with Vermothus. Okay, so here's what's in the... Uh, here's what in the board corridor. So there's a dread guard, which is a guard. Here is Warson Guards Bandmaster. If you want a queue for Warson Guards, talk to this guy. And here is Horde Warbringer. Speak, friend. Which is some kind of PvP vendor or something. And then here's Arthabasian, if you want to enter Arthabasian. And that's and here's Al Alec Valley. If you want to enter Alec Valley, so the that's PvP up. for what's on guards, Arthur Beijing, and Etric Valley were not out yet in Classic, so they're still in phasing. Okay, so there's Savannah, her very old old model when the game first came out. This is what Savannah looks like. So, as you can see, she is now a night elf. We are the Forsaken. We will slaughter uh, anyone who stands in our way. 
This is what Savannah's uh, looked like back in the day when the game came out. What are we if not slaves to this torment? And uh, she has the same voice when uh, Warcraft 3 came out. So it's the same voice as that. And then here is. What would you ask? Uh, of some death? kind of ghost named Shalindra. And here's Vermathus. Don't waste my time. So Vermathus used to be here in when the game came out too. And here's a quest for me. All right, so this is the world portal. Now we're going to uh, get out of here and go this way. All right. So now we're going to go into. The rogues corridor. Once I uh, get out of here. All right, so I finally came out. Now I want us to go this way. Okay, so there's a uh, there's Boyle, who is a zombie, an NPC. And then over here, there's like so many vendors you can uh, buy. So this is what is it? And then Gant, and then here's a zombie vendor who is in alchemy supplies. So here's an old uh, vendor if you have an alchemist. Speak quickly. Okay, now we're gonna go this way. Now down here will take you all the way to the alchemist lab. So this is how you get to the lab this way. But I'm not gonna go down there because I already show you guys what's down there. Alright, so now we can start heading the other way. Okay, so now we're gonna go this way now. We're going into the rogues corridor. Alright. So this is what the walks corner look like. So there's more vendors. This is uh, engineering. I am. And there's the engineering supplies. Speak this is your profession trainer to learn engineering. And that's it for over here. And there's a. I haven't got all. I'm not sure this is a vendor, but she's nothing. That's a for. All right, so this is the world trainers. There's like three of them: one over there, one over there, and one over there. So this is the world trainer. And then we have uh, an NPC undead who's just walking by. And let's see what's over here. What do you require? Okay, so there's nothing over here. Okay, so I already show you guys this so far. Okay, now we're gonna move out and move on to another one. We're gonna go this way and go to the magic corridor. Okay, so I'm almost to the magic corridor. And here's the magic corridor. Now on this dock right here, this is where you can get your fishing. I have so this is your fishing trainer and supplies. 
Now, here's what the magic coda is. So, basically, this is the mages to what go to. Is it? Here's the master shadow weaver tailor. What now? And here's a another NPC. Now over here in the middle, here is your mage yes. trainer. Another mage trainer. Yes. And this is your warlock trainer. And that's your demon trainer. Alright, so here's another mage trainer again. And then over here, there's mob warlocks testing some kind of spell one, and there's demon. Okay, so they made her disappear. And so yeah, they must be doing some kind of spells. Oh, now they got a fur hound. Okay. Alright, so let's see, what's inside the other places? Um, oh yeah, I forgot upstairs. There's one thing I need to show you. Okay, so up here. Uh, that's another, that's another warlock trainer right here. And then up here is a portal trainer for mages. Now, I can actually climb this. So let's see if I can get access to this again. Oh no! I can't gain access anymore. It's just one. Alright, so this is what the magic color is. Now we're gonna switch over to the war corridor. And then there should be a tunnel that takes you to um honestly and back in again. Okay, so that might be be somewhere over here. All right, so here is uh, the war corridor. So there's a seeker for the undead, and here's the war trainer. And a war trainer and a war trainer. What will you and like press any turn. And there's the priest trainer right here. And then over here we have some kind of fight going on here. Let's see. Okay, so there's nothing special going on over here. There's like people either cheering or just getting really upset because I have no idea what they're saying about. Okay, so let's see. Um, okay, I think I sh Oh, here we go. Here's the target dummies. Uh, training some target on a target dummy. And I have no idea where the target is for you guys to practice. That is what I need to find in another city. So where is the... Oh wait, the sewers. I passed it out. That's what I'm trying to look for. Alright. 
So now we're gonna go to the sewers. And we need to go this way. Alright, and then we need to go... Oh, one way. One way. Wait, where's the pathway? Did I, did I lost the pathway? Maybe there's uh, another room somewhere? Okay, well I'm not really seeing how to get there. Oh, here's another priest trainer. Speak. So there's another one. And another priest trainer. And here's a war trainer. A war trainer and another war trainer. So a lot of war trainers in this middle part. Alright, so I'm not. I have no idea how you get to the sewer. Is there a way to get there? I don't think there's a way I can get to the sewers. Um, no, I don't see a way. There should be like a way to get to the a secret cave because I remember seeing one before. Oh wait, maybe I have to go that way. Okay, I think I might figure it out. So, it is, if you go that way, you gotta go this pathway, right here? Oh no, it's up there. Alright, so I'm up here. And this is what the sewers take you to. Okay. So we're going to the sewers. Alright, so I'm in the sewers. We're almost uh, to go the entrance, I believe. What is this? This is a pass. Oh, okay, okay. So we need to keep going this way then. Alright, we're almost to the sewers. I mean, we're almost to the entrance. Almost there. And there it is. There's the like so there's basically two ways you can enter under city in classic. One of them is to uh, go inside this cave and the other way is just quick and easy just open the doors and then you're in so quick and easy. Now I need to go back. So let's see if I can find my way out of here. Alright, we're almost there. Can't get up there for some reason. Have to go this way. But there might be a way you can get up there. Um. Oh, well then. Never mind.
And we got some boulders, it seems. Is that thing moving when I'm- Oh, wait, was that a Mew? Oh, no. It's just some hallway. No mind. Alright, so yeah, there's two guardians protecting this entrance. And... Let's see if I can, uh... Before I... Hope I don't die. And... There we go, we made it. Alright. Is that everything I have to show you in the other city? Don't think I'm missing anything else. Alright, so there you guys have it. That's the uh, classic Under City. But now we're gonna switch it to retail Under City. Alright, so now I'm in retail WoW. So now I'm gonna show you guys how Under City is right now. So there's two versions of Under City. So this is gonna be the Under City that got destroyed, and then after that, I will show you how Under City is right now. So let's get started. Let me get my mouth, and here we go. All right. So this is how Under City is right now. It got completely destroyed by the Lions and the Horde. So in Battle for Azeroth, you get to start a, a scenario. Is when you that's when how, that's how you get that's how you uh, get to the new zones. You have to do the battle for Lord One, and then this is how uh, it is right now. So everything is now like uh, completely destroyed. So there's the alliance, and uh, yep, everything is like completely dead now. I'll show you where I'm at in the map. So this is all of Triple Glades. Everything is destroyed except for the Stung Zone. I don't think that's destroyed. So, yep, this is what um, Triple Glades look like now for because uh, everything is destroyed. So lots of destruction, some buildings. Everything is all dead. And, uh, yeah. So, you can't go here anymore, but there's nothing you can do, actually. Since it's all dead, and it's, like, nothing to, um, do. But, I'm gonna show you guys, uh, how this, I like how it used to be. So, yeah, after this, I'm going back in time, how honest it is right now. Or oh, how it used to be, actually. Uh, so yeah, lots of destruction. Trees are burnt, fire on the ground. Uh, there's some fire everywhere. There's some plague. Now, I can't go near it or else will die, so I'm not gonna go into the plague. The plague, I mean. There's the tower where the Zeppelin used to be, where you have to go to the to get to Orgrimmar. So there's another city. I mean, to there's the flags. And let's see, is it? I don't think the Star Zone got destroyed. Um, there's the graveyard for Brill. Brill's destroyed. Let's see what's going on over here. Anything over here? Uh, nope, nothing over here except for dead stuff. There is some skeletons walking somewhere. Oh, here's one. So there's a uh, uh, a soldier, undead soldiers. So yeah, there's lots of undead skeletons walking around. Here's the. Alliance, we're about to, about to begin the war. So, this is the Moloch village. There's no Molochs that are dead now. And then we're gonna go this way. So, yeah, I don't think the Stung Zones ha is 
got destroyed. I think it's just like the undercity and the main part of Triple Glades. So yeah, everything is like dead and burnt to the ground. Alright, so let's see if we can get to Undercity. I'm not sure if I can, but I'll try. Uh, so yeah, this is how Undercity looks like right now. This is how it is. So this is the new Undercity. This is the the Undercity where they had uh, buildings and things on it. And here's some more stuff. Well, I can't get too close. I don't want to die. But yeah. Uh. So yeah. Lots of stuff happening. So there's the whole catapults when they use that for the war. So let's see, um, yeah, I can't, so, can't really go inside the Undercity itself, because the plug, so I might die and I don't want to go down now. Uh, let's see, is there anything over here I can get to? Um, let's see, let's see, I don't think I can. Alright, so yeah, there's nothing over here then. Alright, uh... Alright, so if you want to go back to ta back to how honestly it was before, there's a uh, NPC that can take you back once I uh, show you guys this. Am I missing anything? Oh, I don't think there is. Ooh, what's this? Oh yeah, there's a gate! Yeah, th th there's a door over there also. Oh, wow. No, 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 no. Okay, so yeah. If you guys see that on the screen, that's why you don't wanna... You may wanna stay away. So do not go on the plague because you'll die. So yeah, this is the entrance to the city. Actually, no, this isn't the entrance. The entrance is right there. That's the entrance right there. This is another pathway to go to. And there's more stuff over here. And then, yep, lots of damage. Okay, so now I'm going to go back in time. And we're going to uh, go how Undercity is right now once I get to the NPC. And it's on your map named Zidami. If you talk to her, she can talk. She can take you back to the present time. And she is right over here. There she is. Talk to her. Light be with you. And click on can you show me what Triple Glades was like before? Safe. And travels. then she teleports you back to time. So this is what honestly looks like now. Or well, actually before it got destroyed. So, I think it's basically the same thing for Classic, but you can actually fly this time, so now I can show you everything. So, now I can take you guys over here now. So this is uh, how it is, and uh, you can actually see stuff now, before it happened. There's some guards. Uh, lots of undead over there. Uh, more undead stuff. Some more over here. More guardians protecting. More undead. Uh, let's see. There's more over there. More over here. More over there. More over here. There's that one right there. Some more over here. There's more here too. 
And this is what the map looks like too. So this is what the map. And this is actually so yeah, this is the same uh, map inside Under City. So it's the same thing as Classic. Like nothing's different. All right, so let's uh, keep going. So here's the more undead, the abominations. Uh, there's more abominations. Some statue. Uh. So yeah, lots of base camps on in the city yet. Now let's go. Oh no, let's, let's go this way. Uh, so there's more stuff over here. More over here. Oh wow. Where, oh, okay. I got dismounted. Um, let's see. Anything up here? Oh, okay. It's just okay. All right. So now let's keep going. Let's go this way. Uh, there's a sewer still work I wonder? I'm gonna check that out. So here's the entrance to the city. So it's basically these flags right here, the same thing for classic. And uh, nothing has been changed over here. It's the same thing as classic. Now let's see if the sewer is the same thing. Oh, nope, see the sewers are still there. So let me uh, dismount. <laughs> So yeah, this is the same thing as classic sewers in Under City. So that hasn't been changed. So yeah, still the same thing. And then we're gonna check out the other. Oh, what's is that bat? That's a bat. All right, so now we're going to uh, go down to the other way. And here's the sewers for this way. Alright, so this is just no sewer. Alright, so yeah, same thing as classic. Now there's one thing I want to show you guys, which is up here. So if we go up here, so now in classic, these doors were actually closed because when the Born of Crusade came out, these has been opened to get access to the Blood Oath, and this will take you to Silver Moon City for the Blood Oaths. That's how the Blood Oaths can come to the undead to uh, to go this way now. So yeah. Classic, the doors were closed, and when the Burning Crusade came out, these doors are now open, and now the Blood Oaths can just get gain access to Undercity now. And, uh, let's see, there should be is there anything else? I don't think so. Let me uh, just get my mount. And we're gonna start heading inside the yeah, Undercity. So same thing as classic. You uh, go inside, and it's looking. It's a statue right there. And uh, there's that bell. So that's still there. And the statue that's still there. And uh, there's no statue right there. Another one right there, but his head is gone. And then over here, we can actually fly and see how this is. There's a thorn room right there. And let's start on this side this way. And of course, the plaque is still there. And it says the same thing, so nothing says nothing's different. The door is the same, so nothing different from there. So let's go inside. 
and then we're just gonna put this down. And here we are, the main of Undersea. So yeah, when Classic Undersea was uh, in the game, so I show you guys that the Guild Banks didn't exist in Classic, but when the Born and Crusade came out, this is what I'm talking about. So this is the Guild Bank where you can gain access to your Guild Bank. So there's one on each side, one right there, one right there, and one right there, one each side. The banks are still there, so it's not been the same. And uh, over here, let's see anything different. Uh, nope. The vendor's still there. Quick about your business. So you can buy a cockroach for forty-two silver, fifty copper for a bad pet. Trust no one. And we're going to go. So yeah, same thing. Good vendor. Uh. Are. So yeah, you can buy. Actually, no, the guild vendor didn't exist back in class. Like that was, and then when the that catechism came out, and so then that the guild vendor came out. So yeah, guild vendor. You can buy heirlooms. You can buy mounts. You have to be in a guild Goodbye. to get access to this stuff. Speak quickly. And there's a guild tab yard. There's the guild master tab yards. So in classic. The gear tail build cost one gold, and now we tell well, the gear tail builds cost 85 silver, which is cheap now. And then more tail builds too. Alright, and then we're gonna go um, this way. So over here, cooking trainer. I'm listening. Nothing's changed. Same thing, cooking, trainers, supplies. And you are. Alright, and then, um, let's see anything else. Mm, okay, so now I'm gonna go up. Go here. And here's the light armor. So nothing different here. Still the same. What is it? Change supplies. Trust no one. And over here, you have your armor. Time to stay. So nothing in there. Hello. Uh, weapons machine. That's our business. Uh, more weapons. And then over here. So in classic, this undersea quarter master didn't exist back then, but now we tell this is here. Now this is new. Now if you click on it, what would you ask it gives you a, uh, a 16 slot bag that costs one gold, a uh, undersea tab yard, and a cloak. So that's pretty cool. Embrace and then there's your uh, bat handle for your flight master. So you can fly anywhere you want now. Beware. And then over here we got a uh, trick surprise. And then we got the War Chief Command Board. And then War Chief Herald. What do you need? Now if you click on it, this is kinda new in um, BFA. So now you can journey to Nazmir, Vodun, or Nagran. Which is in BFA. Actually, no. Nagran is, uh. I think. No, Drainer? Is it Drainer or Bunkers? I don't remember though. Okay, so now, um. General Goods. Hello! Mana, food, you can buy bags. Now this is also new in retail where you can get you can get a haircut from the barber shop. Just talk to your barber, and you, actually no, you click on the chair, the barber shop chair, and then uh, it'll just give you a haircut. So it'll be like this. See, it's basically giving you a haircut if you want to change your face, hairstyle, hair color, feature, and skin. So that's it. And then just hit cancel if you don't want to get a haircut. Alright, let me get my mount again. 
Alright, so... I showed you everything on top, right? Nope, I don't think so. There's one more thing to go. So it says... Wait here. So, there's a regent. Glass and powder. To, it's to uh, remove your glyphs. And then over here, I haven't got you got your stable master. Speak quickly. For uh, if you're looking for a lost companion, you can use that. It's a toy now. Victory for Sylvanas. So you can use that to uh, heal your battle pets. Now in classic, it's mainly for your hunter pets. But now when th uh, retail well, you can just lose a stable master to. Um, Bring your bear pets back alive, or if you're looking for a lost companion. Watch your back. What? And is this it? is your inner keeper. If you want to set your hearthstone to you to you in the city. Goodbye. There's a mailbox right there. And over here. Um, what is it? Do a, it's okay. So yeah, I already showed you this. All right, so I showed you everything on top. Now we're going inside the bottom. Okay, so the auction house is still there. Uh, that's still there, so nothing new. So yeah, nothing new from now. We're gonna go, uh, this way. And we're going to, uh, head over to, let's see, what room? Uh, the Apotheum, that's where we're gonna go. Okay, so, over here, it is now complete action. This is still the same. So this is your. And you are. Uh, this is okay. There's no vendor from that guy. Uh, this is your zombie vendor. The alchemy supplies. So you can buy crystal veil if you want. Hello. And uh, this is your alchemy trainer if you wanna. Actually, no. It's down. This is not it. I'll, I'll show you in the bottom though. So yeah, we're gonna go downstairs now. Go all the way down here. And this is your alchemy trainer right there. Here's your alchemy trainer. Nope, no. Where is he? Uh Okay, maybe it's down here then. What will you require? Nope, that's not it. Uh I have no idea where he's at now, so maybe it's it's somewhere over here for your alchemist. To uh, make flask if you want. Alright, um, so let's go over here now. Anything different? Oh, they got w they, uh. So they removed the crying in this game. Because in classic, when I show you that she's crying, but now in retail, she stopped crying because they must have removed it. So it's, you just can just see it crying, but there's no sound. So what else is new? Uh. So yeah, this is what the uh, the party looks like for the alchemist. Okay, so let's go this way now. Uh, since they're flying, I can actually go up here now. And oh, it looks like you can't go up here. That's weird. Maybe I need to go mount more. Let's see if I can just. Well, yeah, you can't. That sucks. I don't know what's up there. Anything up there? Cause there is something up there, but you just can't get access to it. Oh well. Moving on. So, uh, let's go to a different room now. We're gonna go upstairs. Go here. And you can actually. Can you go down here? No, you can't. So. This is still the same. Alright, now we're gonna go this way. And we're gonna go up here. Oh! The sewers. I mean, no, this is. Where is it? Yeah, the sewers. So we're gonna go here now. Let's see. Is anything different in the sewers? Oh no. Uh, it looks like this the same as me. Oh, wait, there's an extra hallway this time. That's kind of new. Actually, no. This is still the same. So yeah, this cave takes you all the way 
uh, way over here. So there's a shortcut. So yeah, this is the cave if you want to go inside the inner city. There's like two ways you can go to inner city. You can go to the sewers or take the zeppelin and go to the old way out to the entrance of inner city. Alright, so now we're gonna go this way now. I think this is a new way to go to inner city. If you have flying at least. Alright, so now you have a good view. I can see everything. Oh, what's up here? Oh, this is cool. Alright, so let's start uh, with... Okay, I'll show you everything over here. Let's just go through the vendors. So we got the uh, Blue Moon. What do you so require? you can buy a bag vendor. Or a food testing. And over here, we got a Dread Trainers. A Sharing Trainer. And then a herbalist. And over here we have another. Oh, that's the same thing. Um, over here we have a an inscription trainer. What is it? Remember. And there's your inscriptions. We have the. That better be good. What is this? I haven't oh, got enchanting trainer. So there's your enchanting trainer. There's the enchanting supplies. Okay. And let's go uh, this way now. Okay, so this is the same thing in classic, but it's a little different now. So, real Malthus is not there anymore. So, I'll show you what's over here now. The guards are still there, so let's do the same. Okay, so I finally made it, and so there's your bad master. What would you so ask? So you can just use death? that, and then you can enter PvP if you want. Powered. Uh, there's another bad master. What would you ask of? And I think that's it for bad masters. So yeah, they must have took away Arthur Basin, Western Gods, and Etrick Valley because that used to be here in the other city, but now it's gone in retail. So here's some new things. Okay, so well, it's still the same. So what that's not that new. Here's a new person, uh, Bra Braga Blood Head of War Chief. So I'm guessing she's like God and the War Chief. Blood and Thunder. So if you click on him, he says, Vermothus? No, he hasn't reported him for some time. So, Vermothus is now, uh, I think, gone for good. And then there's a Blood Elf Mage. Anaria Shola. And then there's a Paladin Trainer yes. for Blood Elves. And there's the War Chief himself. What joy is there in this curse? There's Sylvanas. I have no time for games. So, yeah. There's Sylvanas herself, and is that a chest? Oh, just, there's a chest. What's in here? Oh wow! I got a uh, nice. So that's kind of cool. I got something neat. All right, so back to the tour. All right, so I showed you everything in here. Now let's get out of here. Okay, so now let's go and okay, let's go that way. So we're gonna go into the world quarter. Okay, so I'm in the world quarter this time. So here's your uh, engineering trainer right what here. Now? There's your engineering Be supplies. There's some, uh, let's see, there's, you can, there's a forge, there's, uh, what else, there's your, okay, so this is also new now, there's an heirloom vendor, you can buy heirlooms in here, I am forsaken, and it costs lots of gold, if you want to upgrade your heirlooms to 120, or buy trinkets, wings, so you can buy lots of heirlooms, and it also, Help! It helps leveling if you're like a level one, 
And if you need the heirlooms, you can come here. Beware the living. And there's also a what quest. Is it? So I'll upgrade to the heirloom armor. Our time. All right, and now uh, we're gonna go over here. This is the rogue trainer. There's your rogues. Uh, that's still the same. And then let's see. Uh, up here. There's nothing up there. All right. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's go over here now. There's a locksmith. And that's it. Is there like a, a thing you can go down? Like I said, you can't go downstairs, okay. Alright, next we're going to a different room. We're going to the magic corridor. Alright, so, the magic corridor. Here is that, so that's, I think that's still the same. Okay, so there's this, this is still the same. Um, the Nightborn is new to another side. Uh, up here is the Mage Trainer. So this is still the same. Uh, this is the same too. This is your Warlock Trainer, Warlock Trainer, and what Demon you? Trainer. I'm listening. There's uh, this and Mage Trainer is yes. the same. I'm listening. So if you click on your trainer, you can actually enter the proven grounds and then you can just like test your DPS on it. Dark lady. Alright, and then the no mage trainer. That better be good. Alright, so now let's take a look upstairs. Let's see what's up here. Alright, so up here is the Okay, so there's, there's a portal trainer right there. I am forsaken. Now this will take you to Hellfire Pimentimia if you are going to Outland. Now up here, I have no idea what, what this is. So it must be something... I have no idea. Alright, so... Um, there's some regions. What now? You can buy it from what the vendor. And there should be one more thing. Is there anything else over here missing? Oh, here we go. Oh, no. Exactly it, it has no blender. Okay. Moving on. Alright, so now we're gonna head to the war corridor. Alright, so now we're in the war corridor this time. And... Here is you can practice your DPS on a target dummy. So there's... Raid training, there's damage, damage, so this is to train your DPS on a target dummy. And there's another mage trainer what right here. And, yeah, so there's a priest trainer right there. And there's another priest trainer. And another priest trainer. And now and over here we got a war trainer. A war trainer and another war trainer. So it's like what four of them? Yeah. Four war trainers. Nope, nope, sorry, th it's just three. Alright, so uh let's see, what's up here? Anything up here? Um Guess not. Alright, so there's nothing up here. There's nothing around it. So yeah, there's more training over here. And... Uh, oh look, you can find Nathanas, which is right there. So he's over here now. Make it quick! Do not He's the champion me. of the Banshee Queen. Try not to get yourself killed. And there's a hunter trainer. This had better be good. 
And what else? Um, pretty much everything. That's it, I think. Oh, here we go. So this one's still the same. So I have no idea what they're doing. Probably just cheering for no reason. Let's see, anything else I miss? Um, I think I got everything, I believe. Wait. There's more undead. Uh, here's your drew crafting trainer. If you have drew crafting, mining. There's a mining trainer. Uh, drew custom supplies. Here's your weapon merchant. There's the blacksmithing trainer. Heavy armor. Gun merchant. I have exact. What else? Anything else I'm missing? Uh, what am I missing? I don't think I got everything, I believe. Oh, here we go. Akalaji Trainer. If you have Akalaji. And there's a book. A book vendor. Speak quickly. So I can uh, buy some scrolls. Alright, and let's see. Anything else? Um. Oh, here we go. Here's a uh, cloth Be armor. Quick about your business. Here's the robe yes. vendor. I want to buy a robe. Embrace the shadow. Uh, tailoring. You can buy tank supplies. What now? Uh, what else? What else? What else? Staff and wine. What now? I am forsaken. And I am forsaken. Yeah, so the staff. Uh, I think I covered sick? everything, it seems. Um, blacksmithing, okay, so that's the same. So yeah, I think I covered everything I have to show you guys for the retail of Ground City. Don't think I missed anything. Um... Yep, I don't think I missed anything in the Under City, it seems. I think I covered everything. So, yeah, there you guys have it. That's how, um... For classic on a city, how it used to be when the game came out, and uh, hope, and then yeah, so hope you guys enjoy this video. How classic on a city used to be, and how on a city is like and right now in the retail world, and how is it when it get, when it got destroyed in BFA. And I hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya. Hello everybody, Evil Demon Master here, and thank you very much for watching this video of how Under City used to be in Classic, and how is it right now in Retail well. And I hope you guys enjoy, and make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, and make sure you click the bell so you can see more uploads on the channel, and make sure you uh, follow me on Twitter at Evil Demon Master. And make sure you follow me on Twitch for more live streaming at Evideo Master. And also follow me on Facebook at Evideo Master. And you can also give me more questions. You can put them in the comments below. You can also put them on my Twitter, Facebook, and also on my Discord, my Discord server as well for a future Q&A video. So anyways guys, I'm going to be in this video and I'll see you guys next time on the next video. See ya.